Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to another week of Instagram stories. This is gonna be the second to last Instagram story post of the year. So yeah, man, the, the time goes by fast. The year just disappeared, didn't it? Yeah, it only seems like yesterday that we met. I miss you. I mean, yeah, it was just, uh, I don't even know what to talk about. I'm high as fucking drunk. Yeah, no shit. Anyways, uh, guys, you already know the drill. In order to watch this best, you know, watch it on your phone or your tablet, you know, so that way you get the whole horizontal full view, it just looks better. Um, but anyways, uh, yeah, it's, uh, I've already known this guy for over a year, uh, for sure. And it's just, yeah, like he said, time just flies. It's just insane. I can't believe 2019 is already over. I mean, I feel like 2019 just started. Speaking of which, let's get this show on the road. So without further ado, hey, we did a lot of really cool stuff this week. So uh, check it out. All right. Now, hope you enjoy and I'll see you at the end of the show. Hey guys, not sure if you guys are going to be around tonight, but if you are, um, for Noche Blanca, if you guys are around town, um, come check me and Christian out, because uh, guess what? She's uh, painting a mural. Check it out. See that over there? That's the outline for a mural that she's about to paint for this uh, uh, hostel. Here, let me show you. Siesta Fiesta Hostel. Alright? Out here in, uh, in Centro, alright? And we are literally... You know, right across the street from Megalo Sesenta, all right? If you're from around here, you know exactly where we are. Come check us out. Hey guys, how's it going? Happy Throwback Thursday. Hope you guys are having an awesome, awesome Thursday already. I know it's uh, probably kind of hectic out there with the whole holiday season stuff. Um, I woke up uh, pretty early today and uh, I literally woke up and I was like, damn, I'm really in the mood to edit this video that I really just want to get the hell out the way, which is the last Cuba video. So I went downstairs, you know, came downstairs, made my coffee and just started getting to work and I just working and working and working and I've just made so much progress on the video um, that I started, you know, editing today and I'm like, oh crap, you know what I mean? Like I'm pretty far into it. I'm like, well, what time is it? I'm thinking it's somewhere in, in the afternoon and I see it's not even 11 o'clock in the morning yet. So I was like, hell yeah, feel awesome. I just feel kind of crappy. I haven't said hi to you guys or said good morning to you guys. Sorry guys. Uh, but uh, yeah, just uh, been working and uh, as you guys can see, the noise is uh, back at it again, so I've just been in my headphones working all morning. Oh yeah! Look at that. Look at that yumminess. love coffee I swear I mean it's just something about the flavor the taste about the coffee it just makes it so delicious so amazing it's just I cannot live without the coffee it is the best happy taco Tuesday out there everybody check this out look at this I just got a awesome bottle of uh, bourbon whiskey um, all the way from the Rocky Mountains of Colorado. Yeah, that's right. I had a friend of mine uh, come pay me a visit and he brought me a early Christmas gift. Hells to the year. So, um, yeah, like literally he brought that from Colorado where he's from. Uh, he knows the guy that owns the distillery or something like that. And uh, he brought me that and he's like, oh, when you're done with that bottle, I'm going to bring you another one of uh, something else. I'm like, hell yeah, I can't wait. So 
I just love uh, love friendly friends. Hell yeah. So, yeah, really, really cool. Can't wait to try this out. It looks amazing. I'm definitely going to try it out tonight. So I hope you guys are having a merry, merry, merry Christmas already. And so, yeah, you know what? This is like the office gift exchange. Look, I got a, a nice bottle of uh, Colorado whiskey. Mm, yum, 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 yum. All right, well, I'm finally on my way out. Uh, actually, I've been waiting all day uh, for a couple packages to arrive, uh, only to then, uh, you know, get a notice from FedEx saying, oh, it's not coming till tomorrow morning. So, yeah, you already know. Um, I guess I'll see you guys in a little bit. Let me get the hell out of here, all right, before it gets any later. Hopefully, I'll be back before the sun comes down all the way. Same shit happens over here. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So, uh, but in the meantime, I did get to finish the edit, and now I'm just uh, doing the exporting stuff. So in the meantime, now I'm going to get the hell out of here and maximize my time, record some videos, and run some errands, and uh, that's it. You know, I'm out here at Walmart, you know, and uh, one of the things I needed to buy out here was a new calendar. Now, again, it's December, right? So we need new calendars by next month, right? Yet out here, not only can I not find them, but on top of that, um, I, I, everyone's just telling me, it's like, well, well, you know, it's already the end of the year. What do you want a calendar for? I'm like, no, it's for 2020. It's like, well, that's next month. So that's when we get them. And I'm like, oh, that figures. <laughs> in the U.S., right? We, we started getting them like in October. Man, I'm really starting to love this bad boy. For reals. I've only had uh, the bike for a few days, and today was my first inaugural ride uh, all the way to Walmart because, um, again, I just wanted to give it a, a ride, to get a quick test, um, you know, test ride. And I wanted to see how long it took me to get to Walmart and the ease of uh, going to Walmart on a very, very busy um, afternoon with a lot of traffic and all that. And um, I'm going to tell you, it was freaking phenomenal. It was awesome. And um, I think that once my friend gets back from the States and I got to return the bike, it's going to be very hard. I think I'm going to have to end up getting a bike as soon as I return that one. That's for sure. Um, another thing, um, I, I keep getting gifts. It's, uh, the, you know, it's like it's, it's in the air or something. It's like I don't know why everyone's giving gifts all of a sudden. Oh, yeah, we're at Christmas. But anyways, my, my landlord swings by. My landlord uh, came by real quick and brought me some of these. This is one of my favorite things ever. Here, let me bust one out so I can show you guys. Look at this. All right, hold on, hold on. I'm on one-handed here. All right, you know what? I'll show you later. The point is, is that there are... Mm, oh, good. So freaking good. This is like my favorite thing out here. Awesome. I remember last Christmas he came by and he brought me some of these and I ate the whole thing and um, like a fat little piggy and they were delicious. And then this year I'm like, damn. Where, how come he didn't bring me any? I wonder what's going on, blah, blah, blah. And as soon as I come in my bike today, he's literally coming in to, you know, um, to knock on my door to bring me these. So, hells to the yeah. Now, Christmas is complete. All right, I'm going to chow down on some of these and uh, cool off for a minute because it's hot and humid, really hot and humid. It actually feels like uh, summer out there all of a sudden. Anyways, so yeah, you know, hopefully it brings um, a cold front through. Hopefully, I'm begging. I'm hoping. God, it's hot. Okay, I'm going to have some of these, and uh, I'll catch you guys later. Happy Taco Tuesday. show you now, because if I don't show you now, I'm just going to eat this whole thing, and I'm not going to be able to show you. So, it's like a pastry. It's really sweet and crunchy, and um, it's like phyllo dough, and then there's like ham and cheese and other goodness in there, and it's just so good. I know it doesn't look like good, but oh my God, it is so delicious. Oh my goodness, I ate about two-thirds of it already, so I ate two of these rows. I'm such a fatty. Oh man, and you guys know I don't eat during the day. I try to fast all day and then eat at night, but I couldn't help myself. As soon as I saw him walking in here, you know, with those things, I was just like... <laughs> so, and um, sure enough, that's why I wanted to record it before I got into it, because as you guys can see, I don't even know if they're going to make it through the night. Very nice. All right, so it's starting to rain. That humidity was not for not. 
Anyways, it's nice and cold. I can feel the cool, very cold, cool air. Speaking of which, I'm all sweaty and hot and humid, so let me jump in the shower so that way I can, uh, you know, so that way I can take advantage of the hot water <clears throat> that the sun heated up for me throughout the day. Because if I, you know, spend any more time here talking to you guys and not taking a shower, I'm going to need to use the water heater because by that time the water would be cold. So, <clears throat> alright guys, I'm going to get out of here, I'm going to go take a quick shower and uh, enjoy the rain. Hey guys, not quite sure if you can hear that out there. You hear there's like a lot of drumming and marching and partying and fireworks and all that? Well, it turns out that today, the 12th, December 12th, 12th, 12, 12, is um, a Dia de la Virgen de la Guadalupe. So today they celebrate, it's a religious holiday, they celebrate their Virgin Mary, the, not the Virgin Mary, the Virgin of the Guadalupe. And um, again, it's just like a, a, a saint that they all worship and they all, um, again, if you know anything about Mexico, um, La, La Virgen de la Guadalupe, that's like a big thing. That's like Jesus Christ to America. But anyways, I digress. It's a major holiday. They all celebrate it. I always forget about it because... Again, um, I was born, I was raised Roman Catholic, but I'm Cuban, so we don't have the Guadalupe. We have um, another virgin, another, you know, saint that they um, celebrate over there in Cuba. So this whole Guadalupe thing is like a brand new thing. But regardless, right now, all over Mexico, literally, they are now, you know, parading, um, festivities. It's, it's like a major, major, major holiday. Again, I forgot about it because I'm so busy doing all of my stuff. I'm working. And on top of that, look, you hear that? No, anyways, on top of that, Christian, you know, is going to be painting a mural this weekend. And I've been helping her out with that. We've been dealing with uh, all of that, getting all that ready. So, you know, this weekend, there's also like a big major art event. Uh, it's a big major art event. It happens here in Merida around twice a year. It's called um, it's called La Noche Blanca, and it's literally you know the whole city. Well, the the center of the city, it's Centro, kind of closes down um, in order to celebrate all the art and culture within the city. And it's like a whole weekend that they just dedicate to art, and all these art galleries open up. There's art everywhere, and yeah, Christian, my girlfriend, the artist, will be doing a live mural painting uh, this weekend, then uh, yeah, for sure I'm going to be taking you guys with me. Um, see if I can record something on the Instagrams, but for sure I'm making a, a video out of it. And um, yeah, you'll get to see her in action. So um, it's going to be really, really awesome. I'm looking forward to it. Um, just I'm kind of resting up right now, but she's actually doing some preliminary painting and all that stuff already. So um, yeah, i got a big weekend um, coming up. So all right, I got to go. See you guys later. All right, guys, so remember I was telling you uh, about that parade? Well, I completely forgot, but literally, it's uh, coming this way, and it's going to be coming right in front of my house. You're going to see it now in a few minutes. but nothing much more but hey it passed right in front of my house and I completely forgot about that and I was just uh, trying to panic because I had like just a few minutes to at least record it and then I have enough time to get my camera ready so that's why I had to film it on here but hey and I hope you guys were able to see that <clears throat> because literally as I was recording that I was running out of battery and I had to run back here to see if I can connect it to make sure that I recorded everything and everything went uh, smoothly but um, I think the only thing you guys missed was just um, you know the Virgin uh, of Guadalupe. You know they had like the actual giant. Uh, they had it. The, they had the statue of the Virgin of Guadalupe on a truck, and they were parading her down. Um, it was right behind the people that you saw there. And then you know there was just music and uh, 
that's it. I mean, you literally just saw it all there. You know, you just might have just missed uh, the Virgin of Guadalupe that they were parading and um, just a truck with music behind it. And that's it. You know, you pretty much saw the whole proceeding. There was a few more. At least I was able to film a little something, something. And yeah, I had to throw a shirt on because, you know, <laughs> I, can, I can look like a, like a bum in front of you guys. But, you know, I had to at least uh, show, be a little respectable in front of uh, the rest of the city. Uh, now, um, as it passed by, I can still hear them. So now what they're doing is that they're just praying. So pretty much what you would hear in a church now, that's what they're doing. So as they're walking across, um, you know, as they're doing their parade, now they're praying. They stop the music and they're praying. So that's also really interesting. And another fun fact I learned about this, in other places around uh, Mexico, in like little pueblos, you know, little villages and small towns, and just, you know, regular smaller communities, uh, um, they actually, um, it's even more of a holiday. It's even more hardcore. In fact, they sometimes go miles and miles and miles and do these pilgrimages, you know, when they're going from Pueblo to Me Pueblo, and there's, and a lot of times they just, they go uh, um, by knees, you know, they'll, they'll get on their knees, all right, listen here. They get on their knees and they walk from one village to another or whatever. You know what I mean? Like miles and miles or kilometers and kilometers on their knees. Yeah, that's how hardcore religious they are out here. Hey, guys. Hope you guys are having a wonderful, awesome weekend uh, and having an awesome Saturday night. Uh, me and Christian are getting ready uh, for round two of the painting of the murals and hanging out at uh, La Noche Blanca. Check it out here, I'll show you guys here. Look at that. Look at that. And say hi. Hey, you're tired. Eh, she's tired as hell. We're anyways. So yeah, we're getting some food. We're getting some food right now so that uh, we can uh, fill up on our energies. We've been busy as hell doing, you know, all kinds of art stuff during the art festival. And um, now um, we're going to eat something real quick, um, shower, change, and we got to be back by 8 p.m. And uh, because that's when the festivities start, so it's like 8 p.m. till 2 a.m. All right, so we're going to be at Fiesta Siesta, right? Or Siesta Fiesta. I don't know. Right in front of Megalo 60, Fiesta Siesta. Um, and we're going to be there tonight uh, from 8 p.m. till 2 a.m. We're probably going to get there like around 8.30 a.m. I mean, 8.30 p.m. You know, sorry. Long ass day, long ass weekend. See you guys there. I just had to share this with you. So, as soon as she opened this, she's like, what the fuck is this? And it's, uh, it's a quesadilla, but it's American style. It's a quesadilla. And look, it's a real burrito, American style. Look at her. It's like, what the <laughs> What do you think? Mm. And look, onion rings. You can definitely tell it's an Americanized uh, place, so. All right, let's get to eating. What do you think? All right? Yeah. All right. All right, well, it's like 12.30 midnight, and um, I'm on my way to Ed Centro right now to go see Christian. Um, if you guys remember, she's doing that painting um, at that uh, that hostel um, that's on Calle 60. And um, so, you know, I was out there helping her out earlier today. And um, and then on top of that, what I did is that, like, um, I got my camera, and I was filming all of, like, the Noche Blancas for you guys, so you guys can have an episode on Noche Blanca and so literally I walked my way all the way back from El Centro all the way back home because you know if you guys can hear the event is happening literally right by my house and so now I'm um, I just literally finished yeah I don't know if you guys noticed but I had to stop recording there for a second the power went out again like I said I'm I'm you know the whole party is happening right around the corner 
and um, I guess they blew a fuse and it was like right by my block and I was just also making sure that it wasn't by my house I hope I have electricity by the time I get back to the house but anyways hey um, so yeah right now um, like I was saying I'm on my way back to go see Christian she's waiting for me um, seems like she's already finished with the painting I'm gonna see if I can put a picture here for you guys so you guys can check it out in case you guys are watching this and um, yeah I'm gonna go over there and um, you know we're gonna have some beers smoke out celebrate and um, continue enjoying the rest of the night god I really hope I have electricity by the time I get back um, all right, well, see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed uh, by the time. Anyways, yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying your night. Bye. Hey guys, happy Friday the 13th. Yeah, that's right. Today is uh, Friday the 13th. Uh, you get your Jason mask and get all your, you know, uh, ee, 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 you know, going uh, because that's what you do on Friday the 13th, right? I don't know. Just a Jason reference in case anyone's uh, out there watching. But anywho, um, you know, to me as a Cuban, you know, growing up, uh, Friday the 13th wasn't a bad luck day. That was an American holiday, an American bad luck day. And I mean... That's the way I was raised. Uh, for whatever reason, in Cuban culture, when, where I was raised, it was more like Tuesday the 13th. Tuesday the 13th was a bad day looking. When you look at it, it's like, well, yeah, Tuesday, you know, yeah, that fits better. Tuesday the 13th. You know, Friday's Friday. Everybody loves Friday. Why, why would that be a shitty bad luck day, right? I mean, so we Cubans pick Tuesday. By the way, when I moved to Mexico, it's also Friday the 13th out here. So it's not a good luck day. But... Again, this is Jose's world, so I don't give a fuck. To me, for whatever reason, Friday the 13th is just a really cool day. I guess it's because I'm always full of contradictions. So since everyone's out there, you know, sour pussing all day long because it's Friday the 13th, I'm actually out here enjoying the fruits of uh, the labors of the people that uh, created Friday the 13th. Okay, see, I don't even know what the fuck I'm talking about there. I need my coffee. I'm going to go get some coffee so I can enjoy my Friday the 13th. Hey guys, how's it going? Happy, happy hump day. Hope you guys are having an amazing day already. I know, it's probably crazy out there. Definitely a little crazy out here. Um, I know you, can't, you guys can't probably tell through here, but um, seems like we're getting uh, some more winter weather. If you guys remember from yesterday, it was uh, raining. The weather was changing. It's been hot and humid for a little while, and now finally I wake up this morning. I woke up late, and why did I wake up late? Well, because I was snuggled in, you know, in my uh, in my bed, sleeping, you know, just in another, 
you know, just nice and cold and yummy and I didn't want to wake up. And then by the time I woke up, I realized like, holy shit, it's super late. And uh, it was just because it, the temperature dropped. It's like 69 degrees right now. And it's already like 9.30 in the morning. Again, even that noise behind me, you know, they're building a pool. They're literally digging a hole in concrete and in, in rock. All right, that's what all that noise is. But anyways, it's, it's not two robots having sex. But anyways, um, yeah, so I, I woke up early, uh, late this morning. It's cold. I'm, I'm getting, I got my coffee ready over here. I'm going to get my coffee in me. And uh, I got to get ready because um, we got a live stream coming up soon over there. So, yeah, I only got a few minutes, you know, to run around, get dressed, drink my coffee, do all that stuff so I can go live. So I'll see you guys on YouTube in about an hour, 11 a.m. Eastern. All right, guys, running super crazy late today. Um, just finishing up uh, some things upstairs you know before I forgot you already know just running all the morning errands and I'm already here ready to start the live stream literally I'm like a couple minutes away um, we got Lambo ready we got the computer ready we got the fan ready I'm not ready and I only got a few more minutes so alright guys I'm gonna pound this and I'll get ready for the live stream oh happy day oh happy day look at that Finally, got me some packages I've been waiting for for a while. Amen. I got my paperwork from the States. Don't ever say it can't be done. Look at that. All right, still working on that video for Noche Blanca, the one that uh, me and Chris, you know, the event that me and Christian were at last weekend. Um, yeah, so I'm just editing that. Um, hopefully, I'm going to see if I can get it done all tonight. I need to kind of get it all to done tonight. I forgot tomorrow's already Thursday. So I need to finish it tonight, so I got to upload it because that's Saturday's video. I already got all the other videos kind of done for the week. Um, and then tomorrow I got to, you know, record um, some uh, some holiday videos because I got to do a video for the 24th and the 25th and all that good stuff. So I got to edit, I mean, I got to, um, you know, do those and create those and all that stuff. And then I forgot that I'm, you know, I'm going to be celebrating the 24th and the 25th. So I'm not going to be around to, you know, film many videos. And then I got so many things to do, so many awesome things that I have to finish. But, hey, whatever. You know, got to do what I got to do. Also, on a side note, um, not sure if I'm nice and clean. And then, you know, I'll go back to editing here because, again, I have a lot to do. I got a lot to work on. But so far, so good, though. Definitely improving. You know, got a lot of work done. So, um, yeah. Damn, I'm tired. Damn, I got a lot of things to do. Good thing I got some coffee. All right, so, well, I think I'm going to let you guys go. And, uh, yeah, thanks again. Okay, now I got to really go. All right, talk to you later. Email. Feels like 66, and it keeps getting colder and colder. I'm freezing my ass off, all right? I'm literally just wearing this now because um, I kind of spilled something on my shirt. <laughs> so you know just being honest and so but uh yeah i got a shower too you guys are aware but it's literally freezing it's 66 degrees okay it's 71 degrees and it feels like 66 but it's uh literally it's almost 6 p.m so let's just say 6 p.m and it's 71 degrees um so literally i just i was about to go take a shower but it's too cold and i realized i have to turn on the water heater so i just turned on the water heater i'm gonna finish some editing here um, once the water here, once the water's nice and hot, I'll take a shower, I'll get, sh you know. Hey, hey, hey guys, how's it going? And happy, happy Monday. Hope you guys had an amazing weekend. I sure as hell did. Christian sure as hell did. We both had an amazing weekend. And uh, we're going to be sharing with you the weekend coming this next weekend. But in the meantime, it's still Monday. We got a lot of stuff to do. I've already, I don't know, it's 10.30 in the morning, but I've already been up since, damn, four hours. What? Yeah, that's right. Um, but yeah, I got a lot of things that happened this weekend. Um, as you guys already saw from the Instagram stories, you know, we had a, um, um, a Christian had a mural she was painting. I was out and about during Noche Blanca, all kinds of stuff. Look, I even got a new bike. What? What is that? I got a bike. Yeah, that's right. I got a loner bike. What do you mean I got a loner bike? Yeah, that's right. Well, a good friend of ours, uh, 
that's uh, that, that, you know a, another form a, another expat that lives out here. Um, there's a friend of ours. Uh, he is going back to the states to you know take care of stuff, and in the meantime, he gave me the bike to babysit for him. So hell yeah, I got a bicycle finally. So you know, hopefully by the time he gets back, uh, he you know, um, and I have to give him back the bicycle. I'm gonna be needing a bicycle, so by that point, I'll buy a bicycle. But Regardless, I got a bicycle, and I'm definitely going to be using it probably today. So, all right, hells to the yeah. And yeah, it's also hot. It's starting to get hot again out here. So, uh, back to nice and hot and humid weather. Woof. Stuff. Okay, all the stuff that uh, that we filmed Friday night and we filmed tonight. Okay, because um, I was able to film um, a lot of really cool stuff last night. I'm going to film a lot more stuff to tomorrow night. I mean, tonight, I mean, and then I'm going to put it all together for you guys tomorrow. You're watching this on Friday, and tomorrow's episode Saturday is the actual Noche Blanca, all right? Which is going to encompass the both days. Now, as I was saying, going back to the map, as I was saying, going yeah, so as you guys can see, I'm already working very hard on the videos that I shot uh, this weekend for Noche Blanca, and uh, they'll be up Friday, Saturday, but Saturday is the, the good episode, you know, the one of uh, the actual event, so you guys have that looking forward, you have that to look forward to for next week, you know, uh, speaking of artists and painting, you know, uh, Christian just got home from work, she's now upstairs resting, uh, this is kind of like a her little pit stop over here, and as um, soon as she's done up there resting and doing her thing, drinking some coffee, getting herself straight, changing, showering, all that, she's going to go way, all the way back and uh, finish her job. So as um, soon as she's done out here, um, she's going to be out of here in like about an hour, hour and a half, and she's going to go um, finish the painting and uh, all that good stuff. And then one of these days when I'm out there in town again, uh, you know, usually how I'm always walking in El Centro and hanging out in El Centro, um, I'll definitely uh, take a picture of it and uh, maybe we'll get lucky and uh, we'll be able to take a little picture, a little video of um, people taking a picture or a video of the mural. Hell yeah. All right, back to work. All right, no more copyright strikes. Amen. Man, that was a scary little uh, three months there. Um, I got a copyright strike because, um, you know, some video I did talking about Venezuela and all that good stuff. So you already know how that works. Um, but basically, uh, it wasn't YouTube censoring me. It was just uh, me using someone's content I shouldn't have been using, but... Regardless, it doesn't matter. Um, the end of the day, it's all gone. I've uh, learned my lesson, you know, definitely. And uh, yeah, hopefully it won't happen again. But hey, it is what it is. So you know, back to back to business. You know, uh, hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful hump day out there. I know I am. I need to take a shower. It's getting late. Hey guys, hope you guys enjoyed that. It was really, really, really nice. Uh, you know, to spend. Uh, this uh, day uh, with you guys, yeah, that's right, but yeah, it was really nice to hang out with you guys all of 2019, and I can't wait to hang out with you guys in 2020 and beyond, yeah, that's right, hey, Lambo Wall said finally, you know, this guy, hey, oh, sorry, I just had a lot to drink, I get really lovey-dovey when I drink a lot, cool, gotta get this guy more alcohol, anyways, speaking of which, he is right, though, um, it is the end of the year pretty much. We got one more uh, Instagram week story coming up. Uh, you're probably going to see some Christmas stuff and all that good stuff. And it's the end of the year, guys. Literally, we're already there. The end of the decade, a bunch of other stuff like that. And that's it. It's been a fun ride so far. And it's only going to get even funner and even more awesome. So, guys, you already know the deal. Thank you so much for joining us. So, Thank you so much for being here. Glad you enjoyed this. And, uh, yeah, yeah. Um, Please like, please subscribe, please share, please hit that bell icon, and uh, just stay awesome. All right, guys? It's a late night. got a lot of work to do, a lot of uh, presents to wrap, and I got a lot of, uh, yeah, whiskey, uh, eggnog to drink or whatever. <laughs> oh, I think you're the drunk one, not me. <laughs> yeah, we're both a little messed up. All right, guys. Hey, love you, and have a great one. See you guys next week. Bye. Merry Christmas. Hey, guys. Me and Lambo are still here. Show's not over. Just wanted to give you guys a quick reminder to please check out the online store where you can find all kinds of awesome merch. Also, 
check out joseatiaga.com where you know it's the website for me and all this other stuff so also you know check out discord it's an online community in which everyone all my fans hang out again just you know look at the click at the link at the bottom description of every video here um, where you can just join the community and join and continue the conversation where we talk about you know all this and beyond so please don't forget to check us out there check me out on instagram check me out on twitter check me out everywhere in fact always look at the description of every video you can find all kinds of stuff at the bottom of the description of every video again i'm always giving you all kinds of goodness so you know whether you're checking the description of the video or whether you're watching the next video which you're going to see some here now you're going to have all kinds of fun so again thanks again for watching and i'll see you guys when you